Hello again, LEGO fans. Mighty Stacker here for part two of the LEGO Friends Pets Series 2 collection. In this review, I will be taking Hedgehog's Hideaway, Poodle's Little Palace, and Bunny's Hutch. I shall deconstruct them and then reconstruct them into the Mega Build. Now, I don't actually have the instructions with me because they're right here on my iPhone, but I will download them. Actually, I already have downloaded them. And now I'm going to build them. And here it is. The full mega build. It's pretty cool looking. Got lots of extra pieces. So, let's get started with the first thing you get to build. This appears to be a step up into a house. I think it's a little walkway. Got some nice little flower beds. Or possibly a pond. Definitely got little steps there. That's pretty nice. Second thing you get to build appears to be a another decoration, also the holder for your brush and a pitchfork. <clears throat> Next thing you get to build is two of these little flower beds. They're very nice. Now, with the animals, this is the first you get to build. Nice little treetop for the hedgehog comes with a little apple that's where you put the apple nice detailing all around you can see some brickwork on the inside there nice and sturdy and second for the animals is this little ground level for the bunny and the poodle you get a holder for the carrot, a secondary ramp for the hedgehog to go down, and a little, I think that's a, supposed to be a dirt hole for the poodle to bury the bone. All in all it's got nice little play features. And that was part two of the review, and this is the full review of Lego Friends Pets Series 2. So, I will be back someday later. So, until then, Lego fans, see you later.